Go Bearcats TV here with Coach Hilton Days following a 2-1 win over visiting IPFW. And Coach, what were the keys to success tonight? You know, I thought our possession was pretty good. I thought our movement off the ball was good. I mean, we really wanted to get back to knocking the ball around and, 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 and possess it. I thought that was a key. I also thought that our pressure uh, certainly got us the first goal because we won the ball back in their half and Jack finished it really well. So I thought our pressure was good tonight. Our work rate was good. Um, so overall, I think on both sides of the ball, I thought that we did enough to get the win. Coach, all three goals came in the first half. Just kind of what was the difference between the first half and the second half, just defensively and offensively? Well, I mean, I think we tried to score in the second half. We probably had 10 shots, you know, five or six on goal. You know, I just think at the end of the day, sometimes the ball just doesn't go in the net. I don't think the teams played any less, uh, any less or, you know, I thought they played as hard. I thought, obviously, um, IPFW was trying to get, you know, to get the tying goal, and, and they were pushing some numbers forward. I thought that we created some chances when the game opened up. I just think we weren't clinical on our finishing, and so we didn't get any goals in the second half, but I don't think it was for lack of trying. And Coach, currently in third place in the conference, a couple of tough matches coming up. What's going to be some of the keys to success to staying towards the top of the table? Well, I mean, we have an excellent SMU team coming in here on Saturday. They're nationally ranked. They're unbeaten in the league. That's going to be a big task for us. But we've been good at home. I think right now for us, we need to, uh, to make sure our guys stay healthy, make sure they stay fresh. Uh, tonight, you know, obviously John and uh, Ali got a little bit of a, of a, of a, of a rest. All right, they, they only played about half the game. Um, Stefan, we're a little bit concerned about his injury because he's been a, a real mainstay for us in midfield. So we want to be healthy, fresh. And then, you know, um, I think we definitely have to make sure that we're, uh, that we, that our mentality is right going into play a team like SMU because they keep the ball really well. We're going to try to keep the ball. So, you know, it's one of those games that'll be a tactical uh, game, we think. Uh, but you never know how it's going to play out. Coach again, congrats on the Monday night and good luck on Saturday. Thank you very much. Yeah, uh, the first 15 minutes, all we wanted to do was make sure we pressured them. Uh, Nick made a good step. He won the ball, played into Terrence, and he touched it on to me, and I just was one-on-one -on -one with the goal and finished it. And Pia, after uh, IPFW was able to equalize, you were able to hit a rocket from about 30 yards out. Just walk us through that goal. You know, uh, um, I think Nick threw the ball to me from the throw-in. I just took a touch, took the guy on, and took a shot. That simple, really. I mean, there was nothing to it. I practiced my shot so many times, so that was that's a just an instinctive shot for me. So 